What's going on? The Rico and Mambo Morning Show is uh, 821 right now. <laughs> and man, it's going to get real right now. He let he let his hair loose right now. <laughs> yes, we are we'll get into character. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Felipe Sparks in the studio. <laughs> What's up, man? What's up, everybody, man? How you doing, Felipe? Oh, man, you know, man. Uh, I'm, you know, funny, man, when you get married, man, that's a, your reaction for everything. How you doing? Today? Just married, man. Just <laughs> married, bro. Hey, congratulations, man. Thanks, uh, man. You and your uh, wife, you just got married here, what, a couple months ago? A month ago, yeah, something like that? Yeah, 12, 13, 14, so I won't forget. <laughs> I, can't, 12. I can't believe it took her that long to make you an honest man, bro. <laughs> I'm still a man. <laughs> I trip out on those kids, man. Like, you know, people say, oh, they bully my kid. Maybe your kid should take a shower. She <laughs> has man. Showing up, smiling like pee. <laughs> All right. If you oh, have any man. complaints, felipesworld.com uh, is where you go, okay? <laughs> Check out his website. <laughs> like, for real, man. I could avoid a lot of bullying growing up if my mom didn't make me a breakfast burrito in the morning. <laughs> like, she would make me a break, breakfast burrito. And I'm a fat kid, man. I'm going to use the restroom in an hour. And all the bullies, when you're a chubby kid, all the bullies know when you're going to take a dump. <laughs> it's like, they know, man. Like, you start getting a hot pass. You start walking. People are following you. Next thing you know, you're in the toilet. You hear people coming in. You got to lift your feet and hide them. So, that's sad, man. I would lift my feet and hide them, man. I'm taking a dumb like I'm delivering a baby. What are you doing? Taking a dump or doing Lamas? You're you're a hot ticket right now, bro. You're selling out shows. I'm selling out, bro. Man, I never thought I was gonna be selling out, but yeah, man. <laughs> I'm selling out. Got married to a white chick, so <laughs> so yeah, man. According to a lot of people, She's you know what's funny, man? People like when when I put a wedding photo of my wife and I, Lisa, and they saw our photo. You know, white girl, blonde hair, no roots. You know, <laughs> fat Mexican guy, dark as fool. People writing comments, racist comments, but they were funny, man. <laughs> Most of it came from Mexicans, though. Like, this Mexican dude wrote, um, citizen. <laughs> so, you know, like. <laughs> some, people, some people wrote, um, crackers and beaners. <laughs> Block. <laughs> but, uh, you know, people like, people like are stupid. Like, oh, she's only doing it for the money. You know, what money? <laughs> You know, or people just have different conclusions, you know, like right. like if we would have been two Mexicans getting married, nobody would have said nothing. <laughs> you wasted your life. <laughs> oh, there you go, doing what everybody does. <laughs> How old is the kid, you know? <laughs> but since you married a white girl, that's but where everybody's cool got to win the stuff. But it's cool because I have a stepson now, you know? He's blonde and blue eyes, everything I wanted in a son, <laughs> but more. I'm raising an Aryan army. <laughs> For real, man, people look at me and my stepson walk together oh. and they look they look at him and go, run from him. <laughs> but so it's sad, you know, because sometimes me and my stepson, we walk together holding hands at the mall. Then I see my real son coming, man. <laughs> and we never been to the mall. <laughs> I feel like I'm cheating on him. <laughs> I gotta let go of my stepson's hand. Let go of my hand, fake. <laughs> Give that guy, that dark kid, your real jacket. <laughs> hey, who's, like your a, favorite, like, who's your favorite kid out of all the ones? All of them, the steps in? I don't know, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny, man. Like um, when um, when people ask you, know, like when they tell you, like, hey, your son just had a baby. Are you gonna go see him? Hey, I haven't even seen my son yet. <laughs> <laughs> Slow down. <laughs> Baby steps. <laughs> Baby steps, fool. Oh, man. <laughs> so this song that you have out, tell us a little bit about it. Oh, me and E-Dub from this area, you know, from Pocos Pero Locos, he calls me up and he goes, hey, man, you want to do a rap song? And I said, man, I can't rhyme. You know, I don't know how to rhyme. I don't know how to write poetry. I don't know how to do anything. I just know one, two, buckle my shoes, three, four, <laughs> lock the door, five, six, pick up sticks. So he wrote the words down, and I had a little punchline, and we wrote a song called Taco Tuesday, about having Taco Tuesday. Right, right. <laughs> about tacos. Wait, the song Taco Tuesday is about Taco Tuesday? Yeah. 
So are we, we going to get into it? It's like a Drake song, but not really. <laughs> <laughs> Tell you what, we got to handle some business, then we're going to come back and play it's it. Right? Real, it's, so, it's done by a darker guy, me. <laughs> <laughs> Keep it right here. More <laughs> Felipe coming up next. <laughs> Shout out to Flacos Taco. I feel it kind of hungry. So we talk Tuesday, comedian Felipe Esparza right there. What's up, fool? MC Panza in the house. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to make it to number one on the top 100 billboard chart. He's at uh, 5 million right now. <laughs> we'll get Please. there, Felipe. Get us, man. <laughs> 5 million with a bullet. <laughs> <laughs> they can start advertising, start oh. making some money, oh, share man. some revenue with YouTube. <laughs> YouTube's like a bully, huh? Hey, you got 100000 Want to make some money with us? <laughs> right? Yeah. <laughs> Can they buy the song that uh, we just played? Is it, is, it, is it for sale? No, man. You just download it for free on YouTube, man. Oh, there you go. What you do is go to YouTube, man, and then when you see download, you download it, and then you compress <laughs> it into your iTunes. <laughs> then you have it, man. That's how you do it. You go to your iTunes, go to, go to YouTube on the back where it says um, download right. on your computer, you download it. Then when you see it download on your computer, you compress it into your iTunes, and then you have it, man. You just download a free music on YouTube. See, so here you go for all your tech services. Get at Felipe también. You know what I think? I think you being a Salvador for the Dodgers, you're trying to be a play-by-play. -play. I'm a Salvador for the Stars. <laughs> Hey, Felipe, thank you so much, man. Thank you, man. This is funny right here, man. For the people who are new guests to Rico and Bamba who don't know what's up, it, it, it tells you like who they are. Like Q1047, Rico and Mambo morning show. Rico, he's a fat, ugly guy. And Mambo is a hot guy sitting next to me. Orale. <laughs> he gave me the look, bro. <laughs> Orale. That's funny. They don't have your name, man. Just the white chick. You know who she is. <laughs> And the intern over here. <laughs> Listen, Felipe. Felipe gave me the look like like I'm the drunk girl at the club. <laughs> like I'm getting you, girl. <laughs> you don't move. Eh? Stay, by, stay by the bathroom. <laughs> I'll be back in a minute. <laughs> All right, man. Listen. Just keep holding on to both persons. <laughs> oh my God. It's sad how when they have the ugly girl got to hold the purses. Where's all my friends? What are you, coaching? Ain't <laughs> hey, nothing wrong with those girls, man. They give you a ride home and they buy you Taco Bell. <laughs> it's sad when an ugly girl gives you a ride home and you're trying to open a door and it's locked. And she's just waiting for a kiss, man. You're like, <laughs> and you give her a fist bump. <laughs> I respect you. Oh, my God. I know how to treat a woman. <laughs> Improv.com Sunday show added. Oh, the Ontario Improv, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> Felipe Spotify. Yeah, I had a good one time. She gave me a